Hey guys, Luna here, and welcome back to Skyblocks. I'm doing this as a video rather than an actual um, live stream, just because this is a limited time event. The carnival is, exists, apparently. Uh, don't mind that, I have bye bags in my inventory. I was doing a little bit of stuff for converting some of my things to... Uh, items, but welcome to the carnival. You'll be able to partake in fun activities, even earn carnival tokens and cool prizes. Each day will give you 25 carnivals, which will allow you to play games. You can also gain carnival tickets for participating in different events. Give you th some to start off. Okay, cool. Should be good to go. Carnival goals. If you, let's see. Carnival fun, if you like being watched, like airbags and being recorded and monitored, well that sure is the case here at the carnival. But that's just so we can track your stats and let you complete challenges and awards. Don't think too hard about it. Oh, cool. So you get different awards for different types of things. That's fun. There's the shop. Event buffs and accessories, mask. Want them? They are as my friends. As long as you have enough carnival tokens. Well, I got carnival tickets. There's mining fiesta stuff. There's fishing festival stuff. There's season jerry stuff. Um, ooh, I do like professional gifter. That's pretty good. Spooky festival. Get more candy. Goose uses sea creature chance. Purple can. Ooh, more can green candy instead of purple candy. That's pretty good. Um, mask shop. Carnival bag. Mask bag. So each unique mask within the bag would grant you some intelligence. Zombie mask increases stats of undead armor. Plus, also gives some health. Gain speed and fishing while in water. There's m mining fortune on non ore block. That's pretty fun. Nearby players within twenty blocks gain plus one strength for each of upgraded of your intimidation accessory. That's good. Bee mask. Double the base pet sets of your active bee. Ooh, that's fun. Frog mask. Every day sky blocked by a random region in the park is selected. While in that region, gain plus 20 forge and plus 5 for Ooh, that's actually pretty fun too. Okay. So there's a fishing event here. And I still only have a few minutes left on this. There is a zombie shootout. I'm guessing here? There's... is there anything else? And then there's... ooh, Carnival Pirate Men. Looks like those are the three. You know what, I want to try this one. Welcome to Fruit Digging. The rules are as follows. I give you a shovel, you dig up on the sand and look out for fruits. There's a bunch of different fruits with each different point values. Right click on your shovel to swap between drowsing modes and give you info on your, each time you dig. You're supposed to use that info to avoid the bombs and pick the best spots in mine. It might all sound confusing and I bet you get sure, but what do you say, Shell? Um So if I sure do. Here's your shovel then. So this is currently in drowsing mine. So this is anchor reveals location of low scoring fruit adjacent. This is treasure reveals a high. Okay, I'm gonna shovel, I guess, here. Ooh, watermelon. One hidden bomb in this area, so I'm gonna shovel here. Apple. There's one in this area. There's one in around here. Two he around here, so let's go try here. Two. Oh, and I got a bomb.
Okay. Score 29 tokens. Nice. Okay. Uh, let's try... Catch a f Welcome to Catch a Fish. Not on the haunt of attraction. Rules of games as follows. Given 100 seconds to catch a fish with the fishing that I provide you. Each of the fish has a different color and point value. Try to catch as many as you can before the time runs out. Interested in playing? Sure, might as well play. Okay. Oh. Okay, that's good to know. Nice to know that I have to hold a right click to catch a fish. Carnival tickets. Ooh. Okay, that's fun. Um, I guess I'll try the zombie one. The zombie shootouts. Easy to get the hang of. I can imagine so. Give you a fancy dart stick. Get more based on the armor it was wearing. There will also be red sun lamps around the air that can be shot for points when they light up. Makes sense? Sure. There's Oh, there's that lamp. Oh, well, there's the lamp. Oh yeah, I've got a potion right where is that? Okay. Another diamond one. I definitely want to try and get that one. There's a lamp. Lamp seems to be about a hundred points, I think. So I think it's pretty worthwhile to try and get the lamp. Lamp. I got 10 stone lamps, yeah, for 100 points, so. So leather zombies are worth 30 points. Baby leather zombies are worth 60 points. Iron are 50 and 100. Uh, gold are 80 and 160. And diamonds are 120 and 240. So baby versions of the zombies are worth double the base version points. 
Okay. That's cool. I got some a bunch of tickets and stuff and got a handful of tokens. I think for now I'll get that and I'll get the season of Jerry or stuff for that. So this is an accessory? Yes. So let me put this into the accessory bag. Let me put these carnival things. So for now, because I don't I don't think the And for that I think I'm gonna call this one here. It's a short little exploit into the carnival games. I hope you enjoyed this, and I hope you guys have a good day, night, week, month of your lives, and may the stars forever guide your path, forever might lead you into the future. Bye-bye, everybody, and see you next time.